man, um, you know, there's no crystal ball. Um, you can, even if you deploy AI or predictive analytics and you come up with a formula that sort of calculates, you know, great propensity, you know, if this happens, most likely they won't renew. Even then you can save a customer. And so there's no formula in the world that would give you the answer to it at 100% accuracy level. You can get very close. You could get it 80% or 90%. What they found is that if you want to get very close to uh, forecasting things uh, appropriately and like 2 3% level of accuracy around forecasting renewals, what you want to do is have a really good renewal process. OK, nail the renewal process and then in the, your CRM application or your CS tool, if you're using one, actually allow for the right field so that the customer success manager can update it throughout the year. Not only whether or not they expect the customer to renew, what is the probability of renewal? And then within that, what is the probability of the renewal amount? Is it higher or lower than the renewal? If you have those fields available and you hold your CSMs accountable to update them on a regular basis and you have meetings around those uh, KPIs, not just asking them to input, but you showing them that you're using it, then most likely you're going to get a highly um, renewal, a high renewal forecast.